Let's turn to Russia. President Obama on Friday defended his response to the Russia hack during a press conference. Take a listen. In early September, when I saw President Putin in China, I felt that the most effective way to ensure that that didn't happen was to talk to him directly and tell him to cut it out, and there were going to be some serious consequences if he didn't. What do you think of uh, the president's response, and, and how do you think the U.S. needs to respond going forward? Well, the president's response was sort of an acknowledgement uh, that an uh, endorsement of what they've already done. Uh, the president has no strategy and no policy as to what to do about these various cyber attacks that have possibly disrupted uh, an American election. We need a select committee. We need to get to the bottom of this. We need to find out exactly what was done and what the implications of the attacks were, especially if they had an effect on our election. There's no doubt they were interfering, and no doubt it was a cyber attack. The question now is how much and what damage and what should the United States of America do? And so far, we've been totally paralyzed. I'm sure that when, uh, when Vladimir Putin was told, cut it out, uh, unquote, I'm sure that Vladimir Putin immediately stopped all cyber activity. The fact is, they are hacking every single day in other areas of our military and uh, all kinds of different aspects of American life uh, that they are able to penetrate. And we have no strategy, nor do we have any policy towards that, and it's, it's very disturbing. But just to, just to underline what you said, you're calling for a select committee, joint House and Senate, to investigate what exactly happened uh, with the, the Russian hack.